Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at what is pound for pound the best value Super C in the entire RV industry. This is a 2022 Nexus Wraith Model 34W. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about the Wraith and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. I am super excited to show everybody the Wraith with some awesome upgrades, something new for 22. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea. Hi everybody. How's it going today? It's going good, guys. I have something to tell you. Yes. Um, we have started a new membership on YouTube. Yes. It is a way to get in contact with Matt and I and our posts. Yes. And you get cool emojis. Who doesn't like emojis, Andrea? I love emojis. Yes. So make sure you join that if you want to. If you don't want to, no big deal. And Andrea, uh, America right there. America. That's a beautiful flag. Andrea, I'm super excited to show everybody this motorhome. And there is something super awesome that Nexus did that I'm pumped about. Let's begin. Model is Nexus Ray 34W. But the actual tip to tip length of this motorhome is 33 feet 9 inches. This is the Nexus Wraith. Sits on the international chassis. Let's pop this hood on, Drea. We'll pop this hood. Hell yeah. It sits on the international MV chassis. Here we go now. Check that out, Andre. That's Cummins power. It is a Cummins 300 horsepower engine with 660 pound feet of torque. Very eco super seat, but let me tell you something. On this chassis, it still gets the job done and it's super awesome, and I love it. Get it all closed up. I like the international chassis, international grill. Bunk over the cab with a fiberglass cap. And then right here. Thanks, man! Nice fiberglass front cap. And we do got your cameras right there, left side and right side. And then look at these tires, Ray, and they're Continentals. 225-255-70R22.5 with these shiny Accuride rims. And Andrea, guess what? For 2022, on select models for Nexus, I believe the Wraith and the, uh, Go not the Ghost, the, uh, the Wraith and the Rebel, you can now get it factory with liquid spring. And what wow. liquid spring is, guys, is the best suspension system for the RV industry. We have a video of Will and Jen test driving it on a Class A motorhome, and it made that Class A driving experience of a gas motorhome feel like a diesel motorhome. It is an expensive option, but what's really great about it is since it's from the factory, you can actually build your motorhome with it so you don't need to come out of pocket all that money. Big shout outs if you guys never seen Liquid Springs, we'll link that video right up there so everybody can see, and I just love how you're able to get it on a Nexus now. How about that? That's awesome. Again, international MV chassis, Cummins engine, nice big winch on, not windshield, Andre, what's this called? Oh, mirror. Mirrors, chrome mirrors, nice big running boards to get in and out of the motorhome. Very, very nice. Up? Yes. And then coming on down the side here, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Raise up doors. Batteries. I thought they said they were coming with the sideways swinging doors. Not yet. Nope. Propane. Oh, actually, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on a second, guys. But wait, there's more. Propane specs here. Bing! So look, this one's upward facing, and this one is. But look at these. Oh. Sideways swinging doors. So much better. Nice. Pass through, guys, and check out that power awning, power LED awning. lights. Yes. The whole length of the RV. Frameless windows, and if you see right there, Nexus has the warranty of steel, which is 12 year structural, six year lamination. And how they're able to do that is first, they use the steel cage construction. Other brands are using aluminum. It's high strength, low alloy steel, which is 72% stronger, which means 72% safer. And they use Asdel, which is a green based material, and that will never delaminate on you. 
Love that. I'm loving I love the side this. doors. Swing to the side. Andre, very nice. Electrical outlet. We have a TV here. Yes. TV, Sansui on the outside. Very, very nice. More storage. Yes. Pass through. Absolutely. Uh oh. And then coming around the back. Wow. Back Andre, there's a ladder. There I love is it. a ladder. We do have a nice bumper for your stinky sleeky. 10,000 pound hitch. This motorhome can tow 10,000 pounds. Backup camera right there. And there is a ladder to get up on the one piece fiberglass roof. Andrea, let's go up there and take a look. Hold on, Matt. Here we go it's now. It's windy. Here we go. Up here on the roof, you can see it's a nice one piece fiberglass roof. Not one, but two air conditioning units. I love that. Solar's already on the roof and right there, it's your wine guard antenna. Okay, take your time. Matt, slow. Two steps, last step. Join our membership club. Yay. What are our salesmen taking this fat ass up on the roof? Showing you what Feature Roof has to offer. Nobody. Nobody. Like and subscribe, members, emojis. I love it. Andrea. Look at this. Very good. Okay. Andrea. They don't have Tijuana Flats here in Texas. I don't know what I eat. No affiliation, no shout out, not good. I got food, I got lunch from a gas station, y'all. Please forgive me for my burps. Right here. It's a wet bay. Yes. Very nice. Outdoor shower. There's your sewer connection, yes, water connection, water hose. Very nice. Nice water bay there, Andrea. And then right here, we do have the water heater. And then hopefully the girls just took you for a walk. They did. I told okay. you to. Okay, because I just got the notification on my phone pass through storage you see, hear that america i track my dog through my apple watch <laughs> i don't even track my wife through my apple watch Jeez. <laughs> right there pass through yeah a little bit this would be our generator oh yeah onan 8000 generator and then what's this it's more propane DF. no def fluid well, Andrea, the outside of the Wraith looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. Uh-oh, that's go. not a skip. Here we go, it's a truck. Uh, I don't yeah. know. Yes. And let's not forget the cargo carrying capacity. Okay, coming in. Slide is in. And I'm gonna walk up this way. I have plenty of space to get through. Okay, and look at this. With the slide in, there's still so much walkway. You can definitely open the fridge, definitely walk to the back with no problem. There is the bathroom there, and looks like you can use the bed with the slide in. Seven thousand. 105 pounds. That's insane. It is. And before we show everybody the inside and get the slide outs out, let's give a big shout out to our sponsor, RV Life. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by RV Life, tools that make camping simple. Everybody knows when it comes to camping, it can be a little stressful, but not with RV Life. So first, discover, research campgrounds and other locations of interest with detailed information, but for RVers. Plan your trip accordingly with the popular Trip Planner. That software is amazing. It's going to tell you the best routes, and you can go with your RV Safe GPS. Not only are you typing in your specifications so it knows not to take you under any low bridges, but you can actually use that offline. So so if you're at a place with no Wi-Fi, you'll still have your GPS and you can share it with their RV community, guys. RV Life is more than just an app. It's an awesome program that all RVers should have. What we're doing is a free seven day trial for Matt's RV Reviews customers and 25% off on top of that. So all you do is go to their website, rvlife.com, sign up for the free seven day trial by clicking our link down below or typing in Matt's RV Reviews. 
don't download the app because you, then you won't get the free seven days. So do it on the website, register, match RV reviews, then download the app. We appreciate RV Life for sponsoring this video and sponsoring Matt's RV reviews. Let's continue the video. All right, Andrea, let's get started with this cockpit. Oh, uh, this cockpit area. International. Here we go. You ready for this? Let's hear it. Oh, Hell wow. yeah, America right there. Don't judge this 300. It's 300 strong. You got your mobile collision mitigation right there. Your international right here. You got your screen. This is your brakes and everything right there. Andre, sit in my co-captain seat. They don't gotta tell me twice. Now, what I really love about this motorhome, y'all, is that it's not air ride suspension, it's spring suspension. That helps keep the price down a lot. And I was never a huge fan of that because the air ride just rides better. But now that you do have the option for liquid springs, it just makes it a lot better riding experience if you choose to go with that. And again, nothing's wrong with the spring suspension, just compared to the uh, air ride, it just didn't touch it. Andrea, are you, yes. you bouncing over there? Yes. How's it feel? Uh, awesome. Yeah. Awesome, I wanna go for a ride. Yes. Every time I get in here, I just wanna go. Yes, yes, and let me tell you guys something. When it comes to these, uh, when it comes to these uh, race or whatever, like a lot of people might not be digging the inside or whatever, but let me tell you, dollar for dollar, like Andrea, she's she's about to tell you the yeah. inside. If you if you want to get up and show us the bunk over the cab, but um, but let me tell, oh yeah, beep 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 beep. No air horn, no air horn. But again, guys, what I was what I'm trying to say is dollar for dollar. If you want to supersede and you need to tow ten thousand pounds, there's not a better unit on the market, is there, Andrea? No. Cool. And then above here we have a bunker with a cab. Yes, ma'am. Um, uh, I think it holds. 500 pounds? Yeah. I think it's 500 pounds. Yeah, this one I think is. Yep. Really nice bunk over the Good cab size. right there. It's got a privacy curtain there. Yep, it's a little dark. A okay. window. Yep, yep, that definitely makes it better. And then over here in the living room area, Andrea, we have nice cabinetry above. Very nice, okay. I like how it's upward swinging and not downward yes. swinging. Yes. Right here, sitting in this nice, this is actually, you know what? This is the most comfortable sofa of the day, I will say that, it's very comfortable. Dark, you guys know how we feel about that, but comfortable. Jackknife? No trifle. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm. Right here we do have our daytime blinds, and if I can see the camera. <sighs> Valances, Andrea. Neutral. 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 Not approved? Neutral. Not denied. Not denied. Perfect. Okay. Andrea gives it neutral for the balances. Um, and what are you looking at up there? Uh, I just wanted to show this Nexus sign for those of you guys that don't know about Nexus. Yep. That is the manual override for your slide if it happens to break. Because it could. And then directly across from the sofa, Andrea, is the TV. With, with two windows. Yes. Wow. Big storage above here, Andrea. Very nice. You can definitely feel the quality. It's one of those things. I'm not digging the dark furniture, okay? But the quality is there. And then this is one of the most best dinettes ever. Uh, it has cup holders here. It does drop down to make a bed. And my favorite part about the dinette, well, first, as Andre said, TV with the windows. Andre, do you know my favorite part about this dinette? That it has storage that locks? Yes. Music to my ears, Andrea. Super nice. I am shocked that Nexus is the only one doing this. And I don't know why more manufacturers don't do it this way. Very, very nice. Andre, would you like to show us the kitchen? Yes! But before I do, I just want to remind everybody that we are now part of RVR, yep. which is a nationwide network of dealerships. Okay. We have over 93 in the country. So if you see anything that you're interested in, um, go to mattsrvreuse.com, hit that contact me form, and somebody from our team will call you guys. Perfect. Let's continue the video. Okay, I'm going to show this real quick because I'm right here above the door. Yes. And then, sorry, below the door, that's your auto leveling and everything. Okay. Over here, I'm gonna start here, we have the uh, convection microwave. Yep. 
pretty good. I don't think they used to do that. No, no, I'm glad they're doing convection. We got a little lily pad of power. Yes, ma'am. USB electrical outlet. They have continued the backsplash all the way around. Very nice. We've got a three burner Dometic propane cooktop. Nice. Runs off your propane and an oven. Very nice. We've got a drawer. Okay. Okay. And then over here we have a cabinet. Nice. Adjustable shelves. Yes. Nice solid surface countertop here. It's a beautiful countertop, actually. Um, residential style sink. Oops. Yes. Ooh, very nice. Always heavy. They have an extension here. And we've got. Oh, always. You can do it, time. Andrea. There and you go. We have three drawers under here. Yes. Now, not a lot of counter space in here, though. It is a smaller motorhome for sure. We would definitely need an extension. For sure. Okay, over here we have the Dometic <laughs> um, compressor refrigerator. Very nice. Runs off your inverter and your shore power. I like the size. I like the look. Yes. Too bad you don't get a pantry next to it. Uh. Oh, do. there you go. With adjustable shelves. Nice. All right, Matt, are you ready for the bathroom or do you want to do this wardrobe? Yes, right there. Okay, so this is a wardrobe here. Okay. We've got three big drawers. Very nice. Okay. What's in here? Oh, <gasps> stackable washer and dryer. Stackable That's washer so and dryer. Splendid. Yes. Oh, that was a pun because it's uh the brand Splendid. <laughs> and there's a drawer here. Yes, and Andre, do you mind opening these two as well? Sure. Man, that's actually really, really nice. It is. And me peeking into the bedroom. I mean, there's even more storage right. back there. Right. But let's check out this bathroom first. Okay. Okay? Nice so there's shower. antifreeze all over the floor, so I'm not gonna stand in it. But it is a 24 by 36 shower. That's a very good size. And the head height, it's not a big step up. I really do like that. Right over here is the medicine cabinet. Okay. Good for all your medicines. Okay. Nice little sink area. And then here. It's very dark in there. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh no. no. no, 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 no. <sighs> Props for the porcelain. But Andre, I mean, this is killing me right here. Um, even this is killing me a little bit. It's not a prime poop position. It is what it is. And I just, you know what? Sometimes I just need to sit here and catch my breath. Let's take a look at the master bedroom. All right, pocket door coming into the master bedroom. Yes. It's got a queen size bed. I like the headboard. I like what they're doing with the headboard. I and mean, I like how the headboard's matching the balances. Do you agree? No. Oh. Uh, I, I see yeah, that there's yeah. nice seats. Hang on, hang on. Say that again. No. Yeah, no, you don't like, you don't mind it as balances, but you don't like it as a headboard? No. Andrea doesn't have the fashion sense that I have. I like it as a headboard. I know. And I like that there's two big storage cabinets above. Okay. Okay. Very With nice. With reading lights. Yes, ma'am. Little nightstands yes. on each. Yes, little reading lights. So we can illuminate the uh, headboard there. <laughs> and then Andrea, why don't you show everybody all of this story? Okay, look at this, Matt. Wow. Another wardrobe. Another one. We've got not no eight drawers wow that's insane matt these would all be mine you know? oh yeah my storage would be behind the tv all right we've got that's what i get and then andre gets everything we, else we got the tv storage and then we got a cabinet here very nice okay and then this big drawer my goodness wow we've got another wardrobe over here oh yeah we're watching you okay and i'm just curious to see if there's any storage under the bed andrea Thank goodness this has a high cargo carrying capacity. Right. Because you would need it with all this storage. Yes. Nope, no, no storage. storage. Okay. Well, Andrea, everybody's dying to know what the MSRP is. If you remember, I did say pound for pound, dollar for dollar, best super steel on the market today. But before we give it to everybody, it's now time we give you three things we love about the Super C, three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Let's do three things we like about it. Andrea, first, since we're back here, I have to say the amount of storage is on freaking believable. Uh, I agree. And I'm going to say the storage on the outside as well, combo it, 
And I want to give a big shout out to the team at Nexus, guys. Guys, like Nexus, hate Nexus, whatever. They listen to you guys. They listen to us. They listen to the RV Review Crew. And they change the doors to sideways swinging. Big props to that. It just makes all the difference in the world it when does. manufacturers start to listen. Um, and you guys know they watch the show and read the comments. So big shout out to them. That's like number one. Andrea, follow me. Like number two. I have a like, Matt. Okay, you go. I am going to say I like the fact that they are putting this Dometic compressor refrigerator yes. in here. They used to put the small ones in here and the regular camp size, but I do like this. That Very is good. Compressor. Yeah, for so sure. Good job, Nexus. That's number two. And then Andrea, right over here, I'm not going to lie, the most comfortable sofa of the day. This is smaller Super C. I like this living room. I love the dinette. I think it's comfortable. I like the storage under there. And I don't mind the TV placement. And I am going to give a bonus one. Do you know what the bonus one is? Because it's trifold? No. Oh. No, no. A bonus light. I don't like how it has liquid springs. I don't care if it has it or doesn't have it. I like how it's an option from the factory. That is huge, guys. I don't even know how much liquid springs are. They're $20,000, $30,000, something like that, right? I think they're closer to $20,000. But to buy a motorhome, to buy this motorhome, this, let's call this motorhome $200,000. And I don't know the MSRP, I'm just winging it. The banks want to see 10% down. So that's 20,000 out of pocket. To then call up Liquid Springs to give them another 20,000, you know what I'm saying? That's 40 grand out of pocket. Whereas if you order this motorhome, you can order it with the Liquid Springs. So you can roll that into the payment of it. That's just huge and I really like that. Well, Andrea, that's three things we love about it. Now it's time for three things we don't like about it. Would you like for me to go first? Sure. The bulk car in the cab. It is big, dark, bulky. Don't like it. I wish there was a front windshield. The front windshield would have given it incredible light and it just would have made it look cooler and be cooler and be better. That's number one. Andrea, number two, dislike. Okay. Uh, I gotta say, I am not a fan of the dark yep. interior and the dark um, furniture. It's dark in here. It's too dark. Yep. I wish they would just have like another color palette that, you know, consumers could choose from. Yeah, no doubt. So just to have it as an option, you know, like, oh, I, I want to pick this color scheme. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah. That's number two. And then Andre, and number three, you have a number third? I do. Oh, you go ahead. Not enough counter space. Yep. For sure, not enough. For sure. All it takes is an extension. Yep. And, and let me tell you something. It is a beautiful countertop it is, as well. It's very pretty solid surface countertop. And so a little countertop extension to right. give you that little bit more space would have made all the difference in the world. Well, Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's, it's now, now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. MSRP on this Nexus right here is $259,067, Andrea. MSRP. Just so everybody knows. That's the one with fiberglass roof, stackable washer dryer, mobile eye, and solar. That does not include the liquid spring. Again, liquid spring is an option, not on this unit. That's it. The liquid spring is going to jack the price up 20 or 30 grand. But sale price, we can't tell you sale price, but Andrea, I promise you, you're not going to be paying anywhere close to $259,000. And do you know why? Because we are now part of RVR. Which is a nationwide network of dealerships, 93 to be exact. So it doesn't matter if you live in Texas, Florida, New York, or California, we have an RVR close to you. All you gotta do is go to mattsrvreviews.com and fill out that contact tab. And we will find the closest Nexus rate dealer to you or whatever motor home you're interested in. And we're gonna oversee it and make sure that you get a phenomenal deal. Andre, is there anything that you'd like to say? Yes! Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching. Yes. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Uh, Nexus does read the comments, they watch all the videos. Yes. So please leave your feedback. And? And don't forget guys, we just started a membership for YouTube. It's Beep. going to show our camping trips, 
and our posts, and it's a good way to get it in contact with Matt and I, and cool emojis. Yep, and you know what? It's just something a little extra. You don't need to do it. You don't it, have to do it. But we appreciate everybody who yes. does, because it makes the world go round, and we appreciate it. We, we thank all you guys. Yes. Uh, make sure everybody smash that regardless of the membership make sure everybody smash that thumbs up button and subscribe and Andrea we'll, we'll see, see you next time, time.